Have any of you fallen for the scam yet? Hopefully not, but you better watch out. Today for Mousetrap Monday, unfortunately, I have to share with you a situation that's going on right now that has to do with one of my stolen YouTube videos, counterfeit mousetraps, and businesses over in China that are incredibly unethical and have learned how to partner with big tech and social media to rip people off. What I'm talking about has to do with this mousetrap. It's a brand new design. It's called the Flip and Slide. And when I first tested it out a few weeks ago, I was amazed. The first night I set it up, I caught over 20 mice. Now I've been reviewing mouse traps on YouTube for several years. I've made over 500 different videos testing out mouse traps, and this is what I consider to be the all-time greatest mouse catching device. That's a pretty big endorsement, but I really believe in this product. I especially like the story. It was invented and made by Rennie Traps. He's a young man who came up with the design, made prototypes, and started the business in his garage. He manufactures all the traps here in the USA, and currently he's living in the American dream where if you build a better mousetrap, the world will come knocking at your door. What that means is if you work hard, if you build something that people want, you'll be rewarded. But unfortunately, that's being tested this week. Now what I like so much about this is it's made here in America by a small business and it works well. It's something consumers really want. It's a great service. So I enjoy testing it out. I'm not being paid by Rennie Traps, but it's a product I really believe in and I wanna see him succeed. Now on April 19th, I posted a video where we showed how to use this trap. Then I set it up with motion cameras and we caught over 40 mice. Viewers really liked the video, it went viral and very shortly it received over a million views. So that's a huge success. Now before I posted the video, I reached out to Rennie Traps and I told them this is a great design. When I post a video, people are gonna wanna buy it. So make sure you have enough inventory. I told them he's gonna wanna have at least a thousand traps ready to go and unfortunately, that number was kind of low. With the million views, people really wanted to buy it. He sold it on Amazon on the official page. I had a link in my video that helps me out through the affiliate program. It helps their small business out. And in a few weeks, we sold over 3,000 traps. They were selling so fast, there was even a time where they weren't available. They were making them as quick as possible, but they weren't able to keep up with demand. Well, you know who was watching that? Corrupt businesses over in China. They saw that people really wanted that and they decided to steal my video to make promotions. Now I first learned about this scam about a week ago when a video popped up on Facebook from Violet Bates. It was my video re-edited, 100% my material, they weren't allowed to use it, and that video had almost 4 million views. So I thought I was doing pretty good on YouTube with a million views in a week, but on Facebook, the stolen video had four times as many. They were also showing up on TikTok, on Twitter, and other social media. And the most egregious thing about stealing the video is they had a link that took them to their website. And there they claimed to be selling this trap. And soon, one after another, there were paid promotions on Facebook. And all these ads contained the same stolen video and took them to different websites. But it's pretty much the same. And I learned all these fake websites were based out of Shenzhen, China. They claimed to be selling the original trap, but that's impossible. They're running a huge scam. So as soon as I saw that stolen video of my footage being used on Facebook on paid ads, I reached out to Facebook, I filed a copyright complaint, and I couldn't believe the response. Even though I provided very clear evidence that this Facebook ad contained footage that was stolen from my YouTube video, they basically said they couldn't prove that it was copyrighted, and they allowed the ads to keep running. That is appalling. Facebook knows these ads contain stolen footage, and they decided to partner with unethical businesses over in China over the rightful owners. But even worse is occurring over on Amazon. There's only one legitimate ad by Rennie Traps, the inventor, and that ad was hijacked by the Chinese businesses. So currently, if you go on Amazon and type in Flip and Slide Mousetrap, you'll see 99% fake ads. So those fake Chinese businesses have basically made it impossible for customers to find the true American-made traps. That's appalling, it's wrong, and Amazon should fix it. Now I talked to Rene Traps, they said they reached out to Amazon, told them that these Chinese companies stole their images, their listing, and reposted it. And Amazon took down a few, but not all of them. And they keep growing by the day. It's like whack-a-mole or catch me if you can. For every one you take down, they put up 10 more. It's hard to describe how frustrating and wrong the situation is. These unethical Chinese companies are misleading and scamming customers. They're harming my YouTube channel and compromising my reputation by stealing my official endorsement and stealing my videos. But most of all, they're harming a small American business, Rennie Traps. 
the rightful owners and inventors of the flip and slide. Now, what do we do about this? Well, I filed copyright complaints and the only platform that actually responds is YouTube. Within 20 minutes, they've taken down all stolen material. That's really refreshing for a big platform to actually respond and care about stolen material. To me, YouTube's the gold standard and they prove it can be done. But other platforms like TikTok, Twitter, Facebook, eBay, and Amazon are being flooded with the stolen material and doing very little about it. But we're trying to stay positive. I really appreciate how much my fans are looking out for me. I received over 100 emails personally that told me about the stolen material I'm gonna post a video on Monday showing how great this mousetrap is. It's all new footage. I've been testing it out more. I've caught a lot more mice. I even caught a rat that was really greedy and couldn't resist the bait. But on that video, on the action shot, I'm gonna to have to do a watermark that says copyright mousetrap Monday. That way when the video is stolen and pops up on other social medias, it'll be easier to file a copyright complaint. Thank you so much for watching. If you wanna help support my channel, and a small American business, click the link down below, the only official place to buy the flip and slide mousetrap. Well, sorry to rant, but I just wanted to let you know what's going on. Thank you so much for your support. Tune in on Monday for a great video and have a wonderful day.